know, we know full well now, it's a well-told well -told story that social media companies have to come down harder on racist abuse. I think we have to start to isolate these individuals who are attacking the players in a racist manner and isolate them by writing to their employers so that ultimately there is total accountability and there is suffering and consequence. But also that, to be fair, there is consequence within the game through the FA, the Premier League and other organisations, UEFA and FIFA. For some of them to be abused is unforgivable, really. Um, I know a lot of that has come from abroad. You know, the people that track those things have been able to explain that, um, but not all of it. And um, it's just not what we stand for. We, we, I think, have been a, a beacon of light in bringing people together, in people being able to relate to the national team. and. The national team stands for everybody. And... and to those who have been directing racist abuse at some of the players, I say shame on you and I hope you will crawl back under the rock from which you emerged. <laughs>